All right, well, I've got a car full of tools, but I have a working dash. Um, this was a little trickier than I would have liked to get it inside the dash and actually um, pretty secure. I ended up using a bit of um, weird odd materials like beer koozies and, <laughs> and other crap like that. I had to reposition the um, the uh, the radio inside just to make sure it was just far enough back that it wasn't helping me at all. So I moved it forward and now with the help of a little bit of koozie foam um, this rests against against it while also being uh, adhered to the outside with some 3M double-sided stickies, which surprisingly Google or whoever the hell made this tablet, the glass on here must be some kind of like spill resistant because nothing sticks to it. It's like water phobic or whatever that term is for, I mean, duct tape doesn't stick to the screen. It just rips right off like you were peeling off the protective film. Um, so anyway, this works, and now it's Bluetooth connected to the car. So that works great. And if we open up dash command, I've got the, um, I don't know if you, you can't see it, but it's, it's plugged on. We'll put this. Um, there it is. Yeah, that's, that's plugged in and it's reading. So let's turn the car on. And see if we can't connect it. Go back home. Here we go, go for connect. Now this is the trial version, so I might have already eaten up all of my... I have one minute left. Good, good. One minute left on the trial version. So we'll go to the dash, and here we are. I'll have to buy this because this is a really cool app, so... Here we go. It's, it's got about a second delay, but while cruising, you, you don't really notice. While I was driving a little bit earlier, I gotta say, that little bit of delay, you, you just don't notice it. It's pretty up to speed with the uh, miles per hour, it's, it's pretty exact. You can go through this for um, a little more precise information. I've got to say a lot of this information, I really don't even know what half of it truly means. I know, I, I, I kind of know what it means. These are neat, you can change these around to the ambient temperature, your coolant load, um, timing. And it cut me off. Well, at least I got a little bit on the video. So, well that's that, and we'll just X out of there. Um, I have yet to hook it up to the internet, but jailbreaking a phone is something I've done before, so I'm not too worried about getting it hooked up to the internet. Now I've just gotta play with uh, MicroDroid, or MacroDroid. Uh, the program and get it all set up so that it does all these connections for me every single time and I think we're set uh, I also have to this this little button I sharpied it in a little bit and I gotta say it's dimmer than it was but that's still a pretty bright little light so I say with that I'm gonna paint that black with that black that is not too bad. I mean, I changed I changed my interior lighting to match the motif here, and uh, it's all good. I might even find a way to change the little the colors on these things. So, all right, that's all I got. Bye.